You are watching Master of PDFs. Summarize and explain PDFs. Well, hello and congratulations. Two modules are done and you've successfully mastered your scanning, PDFing, editing training. You are now entering an artificial zone. Beware of giddy productivity. I'm just kidding. This module will teach you how to chat with your documents as if, well, as if they could talk, to work with materials together as a team and to speed up and enhance your studying. Let's go. So why chat with a PDF? Basically, it's easier. Imagine that you're struggling with dense research papers or lengthy articles. You can just ask this article to make a quick summary or simplify content. With iScanner, you can scan any paper and then start transforming it with the AI chat feature based on GPT chat. Here's what it looks like. Scan an article or add a PDF straight from my device. Then, in the top right of the screen, tap the AI button. Here, you'll see various ready-made prompts for your scan. Then, at the bottom, there's a chat box to write your own question. Now we can write whatever we need right here. For example, create a short and simple explanation of the article concept. Done. See? Easy. You can write your query to ask AI in your own words in any language. You can copy and paste the output to the same document by adding a new page. Let's think what else we can ask for. Wait a minute. It's so beautiful outside. Let's go out. So summarize this PDF in key bullet points. Prepare five revision questions on the material. Describe the problem the research seeks to address. Describe the context of the research, including unresolved questions, current events, or other relevant contextual factors. Provide a detailed description of the research methodology. Provide the top five key findings of the research and identify the relevant limitations of the research. And the list goes on and on and on. To get better results, it's important to give as much context as possible to the AI so that it understands the conditions under which we want to obtain our answers. Instead of asking, summarize the research paper, ask, summarize the research paper in a single paragraph, then create a markdown list of the main arguments or findings presented in each section. Finally, highlight any questions or future research directions suggested by the authors, if applicable. Also, don't take the first answer as the final one. You need to give AI some time to think. Requesting a step-by-step -step explanation before an answer can help the model arrive more logically to an accurate conclusion. Additionally, ask the model if it missed anything in previous responses. Now that we've learned how to get things done faster with Ask AI, let's move to the next level. In the upcoming video, you'll learn how to use AI to repurpose, extend, or reuse documents. I'm going back inside because it's getting pretty windy. Next on Master of PDFs.